Okay, we're doing the Elite Four today. We are, here's what we're rocking. We've got Leftovers, Gyarados, Elite, gonna try and set up on the, um, uh, uh, Big Bell guy that I forgot the name of. Um, since he's got a lower attack stats and whatnot, and he's got, like, reflected shit, so we should have a good window to get some dances up. We've got, uh, a gap in the move slot here on Sand Slash. We're holding back for when it feels like what goes in that slot matters. Same with, uh, Typhlosion. No clear this must be the move in that slot currently, so we're just leaving it open until it matters. Um, and then I exited on accident. Uh, Firo, Expert Belt. Uh, rocking the moose that it's had forever with, you know, PP ups now, which we've distributed. Uh, XP sure on Lax to try to get this to 56 before we candy. And, uh, yeah, Lapros is the sacrifice for the squad here. Um, so that's the idea. Gyarados sweep, get a level on Gyarados and Lax, and then candy for the next, uh, next trainer. And if it doesn't work, uh, well, that's, that's the run, and it's been nice knowing y'all. I'm not gonna lie, I, I doubt we beat Red in this run, if we even beat the Elite Four. That's my feeling. <clears throat> but we got five Mons. We've got some gaps in our our, uh, our team con. <laughs> some pretty substantial gaps. So we'll see what we can do here. Um, Alright, so the... Bronzong is Gravity, Reflect, Payback, and Psychic. Is it gonna use Gravity? Is That's like what? Five turns of no flying or some shit, right? It does use it. Okay, um... I don't know what it what it wants to do to me because of that. It's fine. I like to still out the reflect, but it might take a few turns to kill this even at full setup, so uh, we might end up in a weird situation. Okay, payback. I don't... I don't know if we actually really need, like, full setup here necessarily that's still a lot of damage uh dragon dance one more time then go for the kill when reflect is down or do damage now to get the kill okay we are at plus four. I am pretty confident we kill most things. Yeah, my biggest concern here, I think the thing that fucks us the most is if we don't get the kill through reflect, like when reflect is down, if we don't get the kill on this. I think that messes everything up really badly. Um, I'm gonna bite here. Yeah. Yeah, that, that's exactly what I was worried about. There's the reflect off. Uh, we don't, we don't kill, um, try to flinch. Nice. Okay, gravity's back to normal, no reflect. Okay. If we didn't get the flinch, um, I think we'd have no choice but to like try to set up two more dragon dances and then sweep through the reflect for a few turns. It might have been okay at plus six, because like, I think it would want to bring in Gardevoir next. And Gardevoir's pretty frail, low HP, low defense. We probably still kill that with a bite through, um, through reflect. So as long as we get some soft bonds to like kind of time out reflect, it's pretty good. We could have, uh, there's like an argument for having protect in this moveset specifically to help time out reflex, but what would we delete? We need bite here. Kinda. I mean, maybe we'd be fine with waterfall, but 
Slowbro becomes an issue. Um, and we want Ice Fang for uh, Lance. I just don't think there's any space on the coverage set here to justify protect. All right, well, let's click bite. Oh, the full restore. Oh, I forgot the full restore. I fucking forgot the full restore. We're not out yet. Oh, no, we are. Right, because the first one was reflected, so it did way less damage. No, no, no. Yeah, 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 yeah. Everything's fine. Everything's fine. Everything's good and fine and dandy. Um, okay. Okay, that's that's great. Uh, Grumpig, really? I guess it wants to power gem me over charge beaming me? Kill it? Kill it, though? Grumpig's got some bulk. He might survive. Okay, if we kill the Grumpig, we kill everything else except for maybe Slowbro. And I'm not super concerned about Slowbro dooming us. Okay, this dies. For sure. Oh, you dirty bitch. I didn't think about that. It still dies. Um, that's, a, that's a play, huh? Amateur hour will here. His play was to go Gardevoir first, trace the Intimidate, and then go Grumpig and try to get a power gem off. But he, he missed it. He missed the window. We're going to take a hit from Slowbro, I think. Jinx should die. Why does this have Dream Eater? Wait. This is Fake Tears, Lelucas, Dream Eater, Blizzard? What the fuck are you talking about? Where's the Sleep Setter? There's no Sleep Setter in the entire team. Why does this Jinx have Dream Eater? This should die. Yeah. I think the worst case scenario is the Slowbro body slams us. I think otherwise we're, we're in a pretty good spot. We could still flinch. I'm guessing it's going to do a setup move. All right, fuck him. Get out of here, scrub. Still don't have that level on Snorlax, but we're getting close. Maybe this level? Or maybe, yeah, that's the level, okay. There's a level up on Lax. All right, Zatu. Uh, I just do a bite. More damage from uh, Ice Fang, technically, but I don't want to risk the miss. Yeah, we, we just kill anyway, so it doesn't matter. Great. Awesome. All right, Will Will is done. They're fantastic. Next is what? Koga? Koga. Koga with a Skun Tank. Okay. Uh, let's do candies now. Let's not... Uh run any more risk on things or at least do some candying uh how much do you have towards the next level yeah like 25 percent. that's fine okay uh so we need to look at okay so the cap here is 63 although lance is fucking wait lance's highest level is 75 Oh, the cap is 64 because the team is not sorted by maximum level. Weird. The levels are weird here. Okay, 64. Dude, I'm, I'm fucking worried about Lance's level cap. Jesus Christ. That's a huge jump. Okay, um... Toxic Dig, Sucker Punch, Explosion, Skun Tank. Why are you like this?
This would lead Sand Slash and just try to kill it with Earthquake, maybe. I don't think we set up on something that has explosion. Okay, so if we lead Sand Slash, we kill Skun Tank. That's gonna bait in uh, uh, nothing. Let's just go straight to Venomoth, I guess. Baton Pass, Devil Team, Silver Wind, Psychic, Venomoth. Baton Pass, Silver Wing is filthy, but I don't think the AI can use it properly. Hmm. Just looking for my angle here. See, the poison kind of just makes this always a little concerning. There's a lot of, like... Oh, his his ace, Muck? Well, his, his six team member, Muck, doesn't have any attacking moves. It's Swagger Toxic. Screech Minimize. Fucking disgusting, dude. What the fuck are you talking about? Um, okay, so... 61 on the lead. So the candies need to be committed probably just to the main team members, if we're being honest. Like Drake and Frost have to carry the Elite Four here, I think. Yeah, we're going to fight a Skun Tank with a Sand Slash that's nine levels lower. And I think that's just what happens. So we said 64, right? Ten remaining. Yeah, I think we're out leveled. I, I think we wipe in the Elite Four just by levels. I don't think there's enough XP. We never did get the three candies from the... Um, uh, the Pokeathlon, because I, I really fucking didn't like the Pokeathlon. <laughs> I did like two two runs, and I was like, no, I don't think I will do this. We could hack the candies in. Um, I just felt a little, little divided on doing that. So we can go to 62 on both of these. Or we can do, like, Maximum Gyarados. Let's do 64 Gyarados. We're just, this is basically going to be, can Gyarados beat the Elite Four? <laughs> Alright. Well, those are the levels. It's committed. So, we're going to lead uh, Dietrich. You need to kill a Skun Tank. So, uh, we're going to go Soft Sand. And then we're going to put Protect on here. So, if Earthquake doesn't get the kill, uh, we're going to assume that it's going to uh, boom, and we'll just get a kill for free that way. Um, I'm going to include all the planning in here because I think it's kind of interesting. Like, the way I, what I include and don't include in these videos is basically the kind of shit that I'd be interested in kind of seeing. I like, like, you see a lot of, like, hyper-edited Nuzlocks, and I feel like they're really missing stuff. They're like stories with no strategy included and like all the fights are removed. And it's like, those are not what I'm here for. I'm here for strategy and, and like tense fights. And you, like almost everybody edits that shit out. And I think that's just bad. Obviously it's not because they get more views than I do. But it's not what I uh, want to see. I think we'll leave leftovers here maybe.
He's got a Leftovers user and a Black Sludge user on his team. Kind of sucks. Oh, if we... What about this? What if we bring this in on Toxic Rogue? Okay, so let's think about this. We lead Sandslash. Sandslash beats Skuntank. They bring in Venomoth. We go to Drake. Because he's our special tank. Drake kills Venomoth. That brings in Toxic Rogue. Cross Shot. We go to Gyarados. Yeah, I see the angle. I see what we're doing here. So, uh, this is going to be Personberry for the Swagger on Toxic Croak. And we're going to use Toxic Croak Swagger to set up. So we'll get like a Dragon Dance, maybe two for Greedy, depending on how things work out. Uh, and then last Personberry, damn. Okay. Uh, and yeah, that'll work there. Choice Specs stays on you, I think. I don't see any reason not to have that there. Uh, actually, no. Maybe Petcha's on everybody else, actually? Like, if the most likely scenario where these guys come in, it's going to be on, um, like, the Toxic users. Does it make sense to put anything in the move slot here? dig i think i think doing dig is bad because it's like screech like or not screech minimize on muck i, I don't want to let him minimize more i think um okay and then drake can actually take the leftovers because he's fighting the, the venom off which is just double teaming So we need to stall that out anyway. Now Drake is at 232 on friendship. So return, I don't think is max power. We should maybe, maybe I should have checked the return base power. Maybe strength is better. Base power 102 at 255. So this is this is 255 divided by 2.5. How does that become 102? Like a rounding thing? Must be. Base power 102. Wait, what? Oh, because I typed in 255. My brain, my brain is bad. What did I say this fucking was? 232. Oh yeah, I 250 over 2.5 would be even. I'm fuck. I. Why is my brain already being stupid? This is 92.8 base power, so this is this is superior to uh, strength pretty heftily. Okay, uh, are we good? Are we good? I think we're good. I'm going to try and save the Lapras to sack on Lance, because I think that's where the real roadblock's going to be. Alright. Uh, let's fucking do this. We took... Yeah, all the damage got healed off with leftovers, so we're going to go there. PP shouldn't be an issue. Alright. Maybe, maybe I could have taught something like safeguard. I can't believe Skuntank has like a farting sound when it comes in. That's, it's just, it's insanity. Okay, it goes for Sucker Punch. That does... Quite a bit of damage, which makes sense, level, level differential and whatnot being a thing. Damn, son, he's gonna fucking... He's gonna explode or heal. Oh, 
Let's protect. Okay. He does heal. I wasn't sure if he would heal because it's explosion. Okay. He clicks toxic. <clears throat> That's fine. Doesn't matter. Crit? Crit would be nice. We'd get out of this without having to play the mind games. Boom, 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 boom. Perfect. Better than perfect, because we used up uh, a full restore. Good job, Sandslash. Good job. Coming in on the, some clutch... Uh, little moments. You know, Sandslash hasn't done... A huge amount in the run after Surge, but uh, he's contributed still here and there. All right. Uh, we don't want to click protect because this is going to do bullshit. Let's just return. Yep. 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 It's going to start clicking double team. Drake, my boy. Nice one. Don't... Yeah, that's about what I expected. I was going to say I don't think this kills. Okay, click Silver Wind. Silver Wind is scary. Okay, no no, no miss on return. No uh, stat boost on Silver Wind. We'll get cleanly through the Venomoth. I don't know if... Uh... Oh, we can... We could... Technically fight the Swalot with Drake. Alright, we'll stick with the plan here. Dose. This is dry skin, so do not click Waterfall. This is going to be clicking Ice Fang, so we do have that mischance. chance. It is what it is. Cross Chop. Yep. Easy. Dancing. Okay, swagger but misses. Okay, cool. That's fantastic. Another dance gets in. Goes gunk shot instead. Uh, how much damage? Ah, the poison. Okay, we gotta go for the kill. Actually, does he just kill me with a gunk shot? Not quite. Uh, yeah, I don't know what kind of greed I was um, doing there. Okay, um, fuck, 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 fuck. Damn it! So it's actually bad that Swagger missed? Because he clicked Gunk Shot on the second one. I thought when the Swagger missed, I thought, oh, we got you now, fucker. Because I thought he was just going to quick it again, and we'd be plus four instead of plus three. But instead he went Gunk Shot, we were forced to swing at him at plus two. And it did not work. I that was that was objectively a mistake to stay into. If Gyarados dies, we wipe. Like the the entire run is over if Gyarados dies. I don't know what I was fucking thinking, clicking Ice Fang. Like mischance was a thing. I mean I wasn't thinking. I just clicked the fucking button. I got fucking set up strat brain where it's just like, do the button! Click the button. Oh. Anyway, uh what do we do? 111 defense on Ripley. Gunkshot can miss. It could be Swagger, which would be stupid, but it's not going to be Swagger. Yeah, we can fight Fira. We probably want for the Muck because we have Aerial Ace. Let's just go. Let's just go Ripley. We just go Ripley. It's Dry Skin, so Flamethrower does extra damage. Like, it's fine. Okay. Uh. Oh yeah, yeah. Random move. Dang, that's really good. Uh, especially given that this is suddenly a real fight.
Okay, Croak is dead. We've got Swalot, which will fight with Snorlax. We've got Crobat, which will fight with somebody. Yeah, Swalot here. Do we stay in for any reason? Okay, Firo on Muck. We could try and use Sand Slash on Crobat. We might need Ripley and Sand Slash to team up on the Crobat though. It is mean look, so we um, we might lose somebody on the Crobat. This is also Pain Split, which sucks. How do we kill this without it pain splitting us? I'm not sure if we can. Giga impact on Lax? Maybe we chip it and then Giga impact on the second hit? That might work. Okay, let's um let's save save you. Okay. Amnesia's good. Free swap turn. Literally doesn't matter as long as we actually kill this on Drake. Okay. Ooh, we could we could crunch and get like a defense drop. That's probably the best thing for chipping this. Okay, sets you on, that's fine. I'm not terribly concerned. Okay, so 80 base power. Let's math. We need to kill with Giga Impact. We can't risk getting it low and not killing. We could also, well, we're gonna sleep. We could fish for defense drops to make sure we get the kill. So 150 um, plus 75 to 225 versus 80. So it's it's not quite three times. Yeah, so Giga Impact's like half a bar of health. Yeah, okay, I think I think I see the angle here. It's, it's just click crunch and fish for defense drops. Okay, you go Sludge Bomb. I... I don't know if it's... I think it's better to get yawned and sleep than it is to get poisoned by Sludge Bomb. Do we think he's... No, he's not gonna... He's just gonna attack here. Don't like how much damage I'm, I'm taking here um, from these sludge bombs. It's a little concerning. He's definitely sludge bombing on the wake up turn. So yeah, we want to protect. Install sludge bombs now that he's using them. I desperately need to fucking wake up though. Just a stall. Fucking Snorlax, you fat fuck. Oh, we're immunity. I totally forgot until just now that we're immunity on Snorlax. Did he just amnesia? I think he just amnesia. We still click protect. Really? Four turns? I guess this is a multi. This is not a three turn limits game. Um, that sucks. That really fucking sucks. That's really fucking bad. He's almost fully healed again, too. Drake wakes up. Drake protects. We need to stall the Sludge Bomb PP, I guess. It's only like 10, right? So that's something. 
He's gonna yawn this turn. Nope, Sludge Bombs this turn. Wait a second. Could we just like... We just win against the Muck with, with Lax, right? I mean, no, because of Swagger self it's I guess. Um, always protect now. He's got to be getting close to running out of sludge bombs, right? He's not going to pain split at least because we're we're also low. All right, no reason not to protect. He goes for yawn. I don't see any reason not to crunch. Or do we... No, just crunch. Okay, yeah, yeah. He yawns, so crunch is better. Because we're going to have to stall. Alright, we'll protect this turn. We, um... Okay, he did have Sludge Bomb left. We, we could try and, like, get back to full HP on the Swalot? If we have enough stall for that? Damn, he still got a Sludge Bomb. Is it 15? Maybe Sludge Bomb's 15. It, you know what? I think it is. I think Sludge Bomb is 15 PP. No, it says 10 on Bulba. How is he still Sludge Bomb us at this point? He's gotta be out! Soon! Okay, Pain Splits. He, he gave me HP, right? He just healed me. <laughs> okay, wake up, protect. He's, he's just plain, he's just pain splitting. Uh, oh, so what do we... I guess we just crunch. People outside need to stop fucking honking. Okay, he's gonna pain split and even us back out. Unless we can stall the splits, which we might be able to. Okay, he goes yawn. Should I just try to kill it? Oh, we were already sleeping. Never mind. Never mind. Never mind. We already yawned. Never mind. Uh, okay. Fine. Yeah, he's got pain split left still. Oh, a pain split's numeric amounts, isn't it? I was trying to figure out why he was in the he went to the green and we went to the yellow. It's the numeric amounts change, right? They're equalized. Like one HP is traded like one at a time, essentially. Okay. Amnesia. Maybe he's out of pain splits then. I'm not sure.
Nope. Okay, I think we want to crunch on the wake up actually at this point. What a silly fight. No, he's still he's still got a pain split. Alright, fine. I'm still sleeping anyway, so it doesn't matter. How many pain split pee is there? What the fuck? Are these mons like pee, -pee up? Like what is What is the deal? I wouldn't believe that we went through 16 sludge bombs. Oh no, paint splits 20 PP. Oh, well fuck me. Okay, so he's just gonna paint split a bunch. Might as well. Yeah, he wants to yawn. Maybe I should just try it for a Giga Impact. Fuck. He's gonna recover quite a lot here. Just crunch him. Just keep trying for the fucking defense traps. Oh my god. Okay. Uh let's 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 up the speed here a little bit. Okay, the music is really gross. 1.5. 1.5. 1.5. Um, yeah, evens it back out. Oh my god, <laughs> this fucking fight. Okay, um, fucking bullshit stall strat Koga. It really is a stall strats team, like toxic double team fucking swagger bullshit. Eventually he'll run out of pain splits. There's a crunch. Okay, he's gonna click yawn. We can just kill him this turn with Giga Impact, I think. Let's let's do it. I think we got the kill. Might have had the kill a few times actually. Now we fall asleep, though. Okay, this is Crobat. Fly, Cross Poison, Mean Look, Toxic. Oh! Oh, he gets the Mean Look on the Recharge turn! I didn't think that was a, gonna be a thing, but it makes perfect sense. Oh, no. We need to kill this as fast as we can. That's a lot of damage. If it keeps flying, though, we can protect it. Oh, man. Really? We don't even get the fucking wake up? Dude, we got so fucking hosed.
What do we do? All right, Ripley, beat this. You have to beat this 1v1. Well, I feel like that's going to be the fucking run there. This thing's faster than me. I don't think that matters that much. Wow, not a crit, huh? Um... Wow, we really needed to outspeed that, and we don't. Alright, Koba's fucking our shit up. I mean, this just kills us, so... Uh, is Typhlosion our fastest mon here? 100, 136, 139, 148. Well, maybe there's a chance that Firo is actually faster. Petchaberry Firo. Uh, it's gotta be you, buddy. We don't even have immunity Snorlax anymore to stall the muck out. So what do we... What do we click here? Let's just try damage. Okay, he's faster. Oh, no! He's faster and he's gonna click fly on his turn. So our fly is gonna fucking miss... Oh my god, we're getting so fucked. We're getting so fucked. He mean looks, we flew, he flew, we come in and miss. He comes in and hits us. Aerial ace it? Try to kill? Well... All right, folks. Um, here we are. Um, well, we got one out, I think. All right, Sand Slash, thank you for your service. Looks fly. Is there any chance in hell we take this? Okay. If we click protect... We just, we're just going to lose the war. We'll, we'll lose to poison damage. We'll never get a window to hit this. Because we have to protect on every turn where we could hit this. Until it's PP pee -pee stalled out of fly and we're, we'll die before then. So I think the only play here is to... Um, survive the hit. This was not my plan, by the way. I was planning just for a straight sack here. Wow, Dietrich. You're, you're still dead and you didn't do anything, bud. Because of the level differential. But, uh... You know what? You fucking tried, my dude. The Intimidate is what saved him there. Um, yeah, and I don't think having any other move here would have made a difference. We just need to take this. We don't. Damn, we didn't even get past fucking Koga. I thought we'd get a lot further than that. We just got completely hosed in this fight, though. Like, the poison on Gyarados was just... Oh, we lose. Um, from Gunk Shot. What is the poison chance on Gunk Shot? I think we had, like, the right plan. It just didn't pan out. Gunk Shot's 80% accuracy, 30% chance of poisoning. Oh no, it's 70% in this game. Wow, yeah, so it's 30% chance on a 70% chance to hit. And that's all dependent on him not clicking swagger. Yeah, this was just... Unfortunate. Waterfall doesn't have to hit through fly, does it? Can we at least kill the Crobat? I'm pretty sure it doesn't. <laughs> yeah. Alright, well, that's, that's how the run ends. Uh, Turns out we cannot beat a hardcore Nuzlocke without uh, random battles.